In this video, we will see how to make a file read-only in the Teams file section. As you know, if you upload any file in uh, a team, it will go into the files tab and anybody can upload, uh, anybody can you know modify the file which has been uploaded because they are all team members of the of that particular team. So I will show you a quick example here. Uh, I have uh, logged in as one team member here uh, and a user and another one over here. So there's two users. Uh, one as Shravul Hamid and another one here as Abul. Yeah. So I'm going to create a team, share it between, uh, add the another person to the team, upload a file and see how both can edit. And what if one user wants to make the file read only so the other cannot edit it, just can able to view it. Okay. Um, so I'm going to quickly create a, a team here. Go to Teams on the left side, join or create team and team. From scratch, I'm going to put it as a private. I'm going to put uh, COVID-19 finance support. Okay, I'm going to create it. I will add another person as well here and close it. So I have created a team. Let's go back to the other user as well so I can see the teams which I have added here. So this is the new team I have been added to as the end user. So this user um, is a team member and the particular user as the Abul, Abul's login is the team's owner. Yeah, I'm going to upload a file and see how the end user uh, can able to edit it. Okay, click on new. I'm going to put some uh, just a word document as a test word document. To create loading. Okay, it's loaded. I will put the comment as this is the comment from user one. And if I go back to the other user and go to files. Yeah, I can see the new document and clicking on it. Okay, it opened the file and I'm trying to type in another comment. This is from the second user. So as you can see, uh, the first user login is here on my Abu Hassan's one. And similarly, if you go to the first user, you can see Chocolate it has been locked up. So, so this is... Um, uh, fine because both can edit. I'm going to close it. I'm going to close this one out as well okay, Come back as a team owner. So now I want to feel um, I don't want this document to be editing by any of the team members. I just want it to be uh, Put it as a read only so others can just read it. They don't need to edit it only for this file. Okay, how to do that? So click on the file uh, The ellipsis button and click on open in SharePoint. Yeah, click on this you're right now as a team's owner um, you've got to be a team's owner to do that. Okay, the file has been opened in the SharePoint. So uh, the same file we have opened up in the uh, Teams sites uh, Word document. So every document that you upload in the team will be uploaded into the documents uh, document library in the uh, team site. Um, so this is the file we want to restrict. So click on here and, and three dots. And manage access. I'm going to show you one more time. Take the uh, file and this little icon, click here, and the three little dots, and click on manage access. Once it loads, on the right hand side, you can see all the current permissions for the file. He says who, who owner and what the owner can do, and the visitors uh, can just view the file and cannot edit. And similarly, for the team members, and this one is COVID uh, finance support. Um, members right now is edit you just change it to view click on view and double check one more time and right now the team support members can only view the file but cannot edit the file and that's it uh, go back here and make sure you refresh the tab okay you're going in as a team owner now so make sure you didn't take away your own 
Bikes as a team owner. So I just want to double check that. So making sure you can edit. Yes, I can still edit. That's fine. Closing it. So the last modified is Abdul Hassan in this case. Going back to the second user. Yeah, refreshing the tab. Yeah, and clicking on the file. And now the file has been loaded. Now you can see it's not in edit mode. It is only in read-only mode and it shows no option to edit. It shows open in desktop app. Even if you click, it will open as a read-only. So, uh, so yeah, that's how you want to restrict as a certain files that as a team owner, you just want the user to just see. The team members should not be editing it. This is how you do it. Okay, so that's another nice trick you can do it in Teams. So thanks for watching. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.